Here now. I put my ear to the ground and found someone who may know the location of the Koinor diamond. Excellent. Heisa, my favorite. A man by the name of Cornelius Toti Butter. Beer drinker. What? I can tell. He is apparently a friend of the Royal Jewel. How will we find him? He frequents a pub in the city of London Borough called The George. Sounds like the sort of man I know how to deal with. Don't be ridiculous. Fret not, dearest sister. I will take care of this one on my own. Come find me in Westminster when you have the information we need. jeweler this evening. It's a shame to drink alone. Whatever it is you want from me, I'm not interested. What I am interested in is ordering another pint. I'll tell you one. If I can outdrink you, you tell me where the famous Koinor diamond is located. <laughs> you think you can drink me under the table? That's a lot to wager on a losing battle. I'll take that as an accepted challenge then. Barkeep, two pints over here. last night. Well, I'll never make it back to the train in this state. I'll have to try to remember what happened. I know I was at a pub, but which one?
Wait here until I return. Right. Thought I'd seen the last of you when you sauntered off to that shooting competition. Don't bother someone else, you noodle. The name of the game is... Shoot the bottle? Precisely. Can you do it? Can you tell me where the diamond is? You have to beat me at this first. Who did what? Never mind, Cornelius. Just tell me where the diamond is. Someone spilled it. Some bastard spilled my beer. Listen. I needed the money. Beer. Fine. I'll find the fool that did this. Oh, blast. I splashed myself. The pissiest thing someone can do, if you ask me. You have to have one ugly personality to do that, you do. I was talking to that yarn-spinning oaf, Dickens, when I turned back to my drink, and it's all over the place. I bet you good money those evil blighters did this. By Jove, spill someone's drink? Why would I ever do such a nasty thing? Sarge, dwindling in number, but absolute terrors in this particular neighborhood. Sarge, dwindling in number, but absolute terrors in this particular neighborhood. One for the books, or so I heard. Lots of sweat, blood and tears last night. Those blighters can put on quite a show, walk away with full pockets from those games they do. Is good, is 
Well, what about him? I hate those bastards. They love to terrorize me. You need to do something about them. You've got the wrong man. I haven't played a game of cards since the dog's age. <laughs> on about that he deserves a kick in the mouth his money is mine and there's nothing he can do about it I have a confession to make I love men in uniform they look so very clean by a Russian cannonball Well, maybe I did. There he is! <laughs> Can't fight me like a real man! Skins and fists! Me mum could... Better get out of here before they start asking for more. Well, that was a bit frightening, now, wasn't it? Uh, I think I'm gonna be sick. None of that now. Come, let's get you home. I don't think I can stand. You must be joking.
difficult set. Uh, Well, that was a bit frightening, now, wasn't it? Uh, I think I'm gonna be sick. None of that now. Come, let's get you home. I don't think I can stand. You must be joking. to join me. Finish, chum! Somebody get the prices! be better than me. I am. And never you forget it. Good night then. Julia. But wait. Goodbye. You know they say the sun never sets. Hey, who do you think you are? At least I know where to find him. Where is
is that button for? you get up here? I walked you home. Jacob? Finally! Now tell me, where is the bloody diamond? Does this technically count as winning? All right, all right. It's in the Tower of London. Surprise! Being held there until tonight's gala finishes, and then it will be shipped back to the Royal Jeweler. Many thanks. Buttons. Now hold on right there. Stir up some trouble. Let's go. You look terrible. And you're late? Me? Never. I was simply retrieving the information you sent me to get. It was easy, really. Something about an event happening tonight at the Tower of London. The gun. I will be attending. You're our in, then. You can't just barge in and steal the crown jewels. She's right. We need a plan. Oh, bother. Jacob, you can escort Mr. Singh to tonight's event. This will give you a chance to slip away from the party and find the Koinor. I'll take care of the guards around the perimeter. Meet me at the top of the White Tower. Good. Another chance to wear the suit. No weapons allowed. Where's the fun in that? I should find Sing.
The jewels are being held upstairs, but be careful. If this isn't one of the most heavily guarded places, then I'm a true Englishman. I may need your help to distract these guards. Just give me the signal. I need Singh to distract those guards. He was glad to be rid of me. Death, my friend. You were right. My lungs are just a bit congested, is all. And then the rug says, I'm afraid not. It's a bit of a problem. Oh, I do believe I've lost a button. Will somebody help me find it? The diamond is on the second floor. It's awfully quiet up here. Guards asleep. I wonder what's inside that crate. Someone got here before I did. Well, if the diamond's not here, I've got to find it before it leaves the building. If it hasn't already. I'll put you down! door, he'll kiss his royal title goodbye. And henceforth be known as prisoner, see. They planted the diamond on the leap? Not good. Flatter me, ma'am. Now, do tell me, how do you two know each other? Oh, we met at the Next missionary time, compound in Fatigan, Your Majesty. The logins were quite fond of the Ellsworths. Uh, Mr. Singh and I were quite close, Your Ladyship. It was a lonely time on foreign soil for me. I was more than happy to have a friend. I'm sure. And now the company has sent you here on urgent business. Hmm. I wish I could disclose the information, Your Ladyship. But alas, I cannot. I'm sure you will learn of it soon enough. <laughs> Wonder what he's up to. I need to lift the diamond from Singh's pocket. Subtlety isn't my strong suit.
Looks like trouble is brewing. I need to lift the diamond from Singh's pocket. Subtlety isn't my strong suit. You flatter me, Mark. Now to find my sister. Tell me. The White Tower. The place is crawling with Templars. I've got to secure the perimeter.
What took you so long? Bit of a mishap. Here it is. What happened? Somebody stole it first. The safe had been robbed by the time I got there. The British Indies Company will stop at nothing. There was a plan to frame Singh. I lifted it from him before the Royal Guards found it. Imagine the look on Her Majesty's face if... They must know by now that their plan was foiled. You're welcome. I think it's time to depart. I need to find a way out of here. They make it out all right. Did you get it to your sister? Just barely. What do you mean? I'll tell you about it another time. You encountered some trouble? We can't speak of this here. The British Indies Company is up to no good again. Outside, then. You, sir! Halt for inspection! <laughs> I beg your pardon? Search him! Nothing! The Corinora isn't here! But of course there's nothing! What do you take me for? Some sort of criminal? Did I ever tell you about the time I nearly journeyed to America with Wilkinson? commotion about, Mr. Singh? I do believe they thought I was trying to pinch the koh your ladyship. Ha! Huh? The koh -Nor? Who on earth would want to steal that potato? Good night, your highness. We barely got out of there in one piece. The British Indies Company tried to plant the diamond on you and frame you for stealing it. Luckily, I was there just in the nick of time. We need to meet back at Mr. Green's shop. I must see the diamond with my own two eyes. Koinor never left India. Had I known you planned to reclaim it, I would have stopped you. My father ensured it never fell into Templar hands. Your father has done a great service to me and my people. My words to you earlier were unfair. You were not wrong. I too have grown frustrated with my lack of progress. Shall we let bygones be bygones? We need to find out who's behind all of this. 
and why the Templars and the British Indies companies have joined forces. What we should do is track them down and destroy their headquarters. Jacob. That may not be such a terrible idea, Mr. Fry. 